Hello everyone, it's winter already. Though it's not snowing here in Kolkata, but in many parts of India, already snowfalls have started and in some regions there are snowstorms as well. So let's see certain pathologies which have inspired our radiologists to name them on this natural phenomenon that is a snowstorm. Okay, so come with me for the snowstorms in radiology. Okay, so here we have the snowstorms in radiology. The most famous snowstorm is USG-based obstetric thing in a complete hydratiform mold. The second famous one is also a term in relation to an USG finding of a breast in which the patient has an extra capsular rupture of a silicon implant. The third is in the chest x-ray. Usually, this snowstorm appearance is described in a miliary metastasis which is usually seen to come from a primary which is the papillary thyroid CA. Other than that, everything else that can cause a Miliary opacities can also cause this kind of appearance like miliary TB or alveolar microlithiasis and the last is also an USG finding in the testis seen in patients with uh, testicular microlithiasis. Okay, let's see all these things one by one. Number one is the hydratiform mole. This is usually seen in a complete hydratiform mole. The placenta as we see here is grossly enlarged. It appears so much heterogeneous with innumerable cysts all throughout the parenchyma of the placenta. The embryonic pole is almost destroyed. This is how it looks like. And we know the symptoms, the patient can have increased vomiting, there can be passage of grape-like vesicles per vagina and all those things. And this, uh, you know, numerous cysts that we see here is secondary to the numerous hydropic villi that is formed and this fills up almost the entire uterine cavity. Next is an extracapsular rupture of the breast implant. So what happens is this uh, breast implants are, they are made up of silicone. In extracapsular rupture, these silicone particles are now free. They are freely interspersed throughout the breast parenchyma. And they give rise to this heterogeneous appearance, heterogeneous ecogenic silica, like you see here, here, here. So these are all free silicone, which gives this dirty acoustic shadowing behind it. All these things, the dirty shadowing. This is the uh, snowstorm appearance of an extra capsular rupture of a breast implant. Next, let's move on to the X-ray. And very typically, it is a metastatic papillary thyroid cancer, giving rise to these miliary metastasis. Numerous miliary nodules can be seen here scattered throughout the lung parenchyma as we can see and other than that less common causes like infective miliary TB or fungal infections, actinomycosis, then histoplasmosis, all those things or healed calcified varicella pneumonia can also give this appearance. Other than that pneumoconiosis can also give rise to this tremendous miliary opacities throughout the lung parenchyma which we can designate as a snowstorm chest x-ray. Next is testicular microlithiasis where we see multiple ecogenic non-shadowing foci within the testicular parenchyma. They measure somewhere around 1 to, one to 3 millimeters. And these are not static. They will appear to fall down like snowflakes. And usually the presence of more than or equals to 5 eco such ecogenic foci is diagnostic of the condition. Okay, that's all for today. If you have enjoyed, do comment below. Bye-bye.